Hi, Long Beach Unified students. It's great to be back with you again today. Today is day eight, where we have had no school like we've known it before. I hope you're working hard on your home learning options, and I hope most importantly that you are really taking care of yourself and other people that you care about. So today I wanna to talk to you about a word that is called vulnerability. Some of you have heard that word before. Vulnerability is a feeling that comes in for us usually when there's a change and when we have a sense that something could harm us or that we need to protect ourselves from. And I want you to think about a time when maybe you've been having a hard day or not feeling just right and somebody asks you, how are you? What do you say in that moment? My guess is that you say, fine. You say fine even when you're not fine. I just did this yesterday when I wasn't feeling fine and somebody asked me, how are you doing? And I said, oh, I'm fine. In fact, I think I even said, I'm good. That wasn't really true. So why do we do that? We do that because sometimes the feelings that we get about sharing how we really feel make us feel vulnerable and make us feel like there's something that we should protect. And so it's easier to just say we're fine even if we're not. Something that's happening right now in this very different time is that we are all feeling vulnerability. We're all feeling vulnerable because everything that we've known before is different and it's making us have a lot of feelings. Some of those are feelings we've had before and some of them are really new feelings. And I think a lot of us are wondering in this time, can I really talk about how I'm feeling? What's different right now is that so many people are feeling some of the same things. And so my message of encouragement to you today is to just try to really stretch into the ways that you can talk about being vulnerable. The ways that you talk with the people that you're living with about how you're feeling. And sometimes when you're asked, how are you? And you're feeling kind of bad. It's okay to say, I'm feeling kind of bad. Or, when somebody asks you, how are you, and you're feeling kind of bad, it's okay to say, do you want me to tell you how I really feel? Because that creates a way that you can talk about the way you really feel. One of the things that is going to come out of this challenging time where we are all vulnerable is that we are gonna have some new ways of being together. We are going to have some new ways about talking about our feelings, and I believe that we are going to be stronger inside ourselves I think we can be stronger inside our families, and I think that we are already showing that we're a stronger community, even though we're having a vulnerability. So tonight, try to talk with people that you live with about how you're really feeling. Ask them about how they're really feeling, and create a way of talking about those moments when you just don't know what's happening for yourself. I look forward to seeing you again on Friday. Keep taking care and know that we are really, really thinking about you.